Hello, hello again, everyone. Indulger here, back with the conclusion of Either Aid's week 87. This is day seven, the final day. Let's see how the week unfolded overall. We'll look at these two defense that came in last one of the week that will count. Uh, it all ended up being a top five finish for me. Just that Theo <laughs> lost. Theo just wouldn't quit. Everybody else did a good job of quitting after two or three this week. So I don't know. I, the, the pendulum swung back. I don't know why, but for the last three months or so, people were just taking everything. Which is ironic because this is what I did this week. If I wouldn't have done that, I might have a good, nice solid lock on the top 1,000. It's still possible. We'll see how we finish up. But as I mentioned, let's get through this defense. We'll get to one mock battle today. I'm going to say up front, I'm sorry, guys. I did not get to everybody I wanted to. I had somebody that I forgot to add to the list. So if you do want to be part of the series here where we feature people's defenses, uh, mock battles, I'm happy to oblige when I have the time. I'm prioritizing new players at the moment. We're going to watch this Leaf try to take us down. Uh, but yeah, sometimes I forget to add you to the list. Just monitor my video notes. If there's anything that looks weird to you, just send me a comment in the video description. Or, sorry, the, just leave a comment in the video itself. Leaf's going to try to take out Micaiah, who's hardy bearing number one, and then Alm's hardy bearing number two. However, this is not a close combat leaf, and I don't know if they were expecting another hit. It's also not a vantage leaf. So I don't know what they were thinking here, because leaf's not going to live. <laughs> so leaf's going to fall here. Um, but anyway, to finish my thought, yeah, we're going to fight Luna today. I decided to prioritize Luna because Luna's been around for a long time, and we haven't has not asked for a fight in quite a while. So anybody that is on the list, I'll get you. I know a couple people have been waiting a while, so again, apologies. Good job, Sonia. Managed to do that Wings of Mercy trap with the Sothis. Luna's got a good Sothis, so we're going to fight the, her today. And are they ready to give up yet? Ready? Yes, thank you. That was the last one that counted. Let's take a look at Castile, and then we'll try to remind myself to look at the top 50. I haven't looked at the actual leaderboard top 50 in a while. We've got a Lucina with Fury. I'm a big fan of that. Now, this Lucina combo is just speed and attack. So, you got two paradigms. Speed and attack, defense and res. I heavily favor defense and res, Ikes. But Ike is so flexible, he can become very speedy. And they're trying to do that with a peony. we get some speed there. We're going to get some speed there. Uh, so, we'll see how that manages. Got Itsuki as a bonus unit, and then Air as scoring, along with Peony. Can't remember the last time I saw an Ike try to tank the left side. And they are going to attempt it. So by going to the left side, you bypass the Panic Manor. But however, now you're in this really tricky spot where... <laughs> you're going to have to... I mean, it's probably the trap. And, like, how are you going to navigate around this? And not to mention, I mean, this is not a very beefy... Res Ike. I mean, they're trying to use Mirror Stance, which I guess Mirror Stance is okay. Again, I still prefer my HP Res because it stops things like Panics. It just is HP scales better for both Defense and Res. And well, I like the Static Res that you get to stop something like a Blazing Light when that calculation comes into effect here. So that's why I do that. So Ike does take the Sothis down, but gets really hurt in the process. <laughs> Can you take a Micaiah shot? Who's, yes, debuffed, but she's got a lot of bonds. Uh, no, you can't. It's close. Even if she, he would have survived that, Alm would have finished it up, and instead, Alm takes care of the back line. We've lost two units. And we're almost home, so as long as we get one more unit, or they quit, we win. There goes Alm. Not looking good. Not looking good. Yeah, you're going to bait the dancer, but... Now, the only one that's going to move is Ophelia because she doesn't have the assist. So why we do that. If you want to have your ranged units move like you want them, make sure you have your assist set correctly. I don't call that out enough. That is a pretty basic uh, sort of tenet of Aether Raids. If you ever want... You're like, why is my unit not moving? It, it comes down to if you don't have your assist set, that will be the first unit that moves. In this case, I, <laughs> I don't want Ninian to go. Since they both do have assist set, uh, it's going to prioritize Ninian. But Sonya's trying to keep her in line. And 
Nadine does a great job of surviving that. Turn seven. And they just finally decide, nah, I don't think I want to keep this. Yeah, Castile tested my trap for me. Thank you. They played Guess the Trap. Cool. All right, let's do it, guys. I think I know where Luna is. Luna's normally at the top of the list, so I don't have to pause. <laughs> Luna's had a good week. 13850. Um, Luna, I'm just going to take you on with my team one. So I was a little scared. I'm like, what am I going to see here? And you got a couple things. I got a couple notes for you. This Roy seems really vulnerable. Now, he does have distant counter. But if you razzle-dazzle him in the corner, I feel like you can beat him up. But don't worry about that. We've got a plus 10 close call Roy. I will say I had to do some sh tricky shenanigans because this guy is the bane of my existence. I totally... <laughs> I am scared when I see drive buffs or other buffs. Because it normally just changes the calculus just so much that things don't die. So this this is sort of like a ball team. It's like an infantry ball. I really like running defensive sets on the S slot, and I'll explain why. What's well, gonna it's gonna come down to trying to beat this Soth, who's got 48 speed, and he's plus 10, obviously, with an impact skill and a low attack defense and infantry pulse. Oh my! Uh, let's look at this Sothis for scoring. Pretty basic Fury setup, plus six. Ignis? Yeah, Ignis isn't bad. Uh, so I Dragon Fang mine. I gotta run the numbers. What's better, Ignis or Dragon Fang? I feel like you're since you have a plus attack, so this Dragon Fang might be better. That's 80% of that. I don't know. I, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you run the math, Luna. Maybe I need to consider running something like that. Uh, but then again, you have a much higher merge one than I have. Uh, we've got... Alm, I will say one thing that it seems to stand out for me is that Alm is really not an Ike killer here. You've positioned him to be an Ike killer with his B, natural B skill. Uh, Ace push helps. Don't really care about the speed. Um, but he's going to get a minus one, so he's going to hit... No, I, we'll, we'll see what happens with him. Uh, I'm pretty sure he does not hit me ideally. And then we've got a Subasa, which has a lot of speed, but... Uh, I'm also green, so I don't really care about Tsubasa. <laughs> Tsubasa's going to die. And then Yoon's here for scoring. Uh, she's plus 10. Wow, look at that. With some orders, and she's going to die too. But we'll get to that. Uh, so, here's what my setup is. I, I want to take care of this level 7 panic manner because I'm just 1 HP short, and that would really ruin my day. So let's get rid of that first. And then we'll get Ike to just squeeze in on here. And then, you know, Silk's just going to go take this whole left side out. I'm going to call out one very specific thing that has to happen, which, oh man, I don't think, uh, I don't think I would ever do this. Well, what I'm about to do, I will say, Luna, I can probably beat this, but I'm going to have casualties, and it's going to come down to this Roy. So I got the Bolt Tower off. I don't really care about the Bolt Tower. I'm not really worried about that. I mean, it'd be nice if I could leverage that, but you've got a level 7 healing tower as well. I do want to test the trap because I want to be able to move in this position. I want to avoid some things. So I'm just going to come back, and then Silk is going to take care of that level 5 Dark Shrine for me. I think I want to break this armory. I think so. And now we're ready to rock and roll. Finally. Finally ready to go. I'm just going to move my air over here. I don't know if I had the foresight to see this, but I, I can beat these four. Now, you're going to be a problem, but it's really this Soth, because he's also got a built-in hardy bearing. <laughs> Great. <laughs> uh, and then, this is, the, this is the weird trick of the day. I need to get this drive defense away from this Soth, so I don't know if I would plan this out. This is just sort of, I'm just, I, I try and get you to run at me. He's got a Moombo, so he's not really that strong. So I'm just going to poke him. If I don't do this, he does not come after Silk, which was surprising me. I just want you to come after me. I, I think it's a cat. I, I didn't realize that the calculus involved the special. Maybe I'm wrong, and I didn't need to do that. But if I don't hit him, the AI just does not work like I need it to. Yes. So let's see how this unfolds. As I said, so your alms got a special ready, and that is not what you want to have against an Ike. So he doesn't kill me, and there's no dancer here, so nobody follows up. And as long as this Tsubasa doesn't kill me, which was close, <laughs> I got most of my HP back. I'm going to get a lot of it back with the airs. 
And here we go. So as I just mentioned, if Roy ends here, I am screwed. Because here's what we're going to do. We're going to try to break this Soth with air. Now you can see he's doing 41 damage. If only we had something that would like an attack smoke to smoke him out. And beat him up. It's, see, I just barely beat him at, at 58 damage. If that drive is there, this doesn't work. And the whole thing it just go, falls apart. Just falls apart. Now I can get that air out of the way. And we just need to run away from this Roy. Thankfully, Silk's got some pretty good mixed bulk. And the Moonbow's not going to kill us. I actually have to break this catapult. If we do not break the catapult, this gets really sketchy at the end game. So I survive. That's all I needed. And actually him running away helps a bit. But I will tell you one thing that really screws me up here as we watch the rest of the units fall. Is this stupid tactics room. I almost lost because of this tactics room. Because I cannot. I need to go now. It's, it's turn six. It took it so much time prepping that we have to go. And I have to get Ike up there. And the only way to do it is like that. Or like this. So let's give him some attack. Break that healing tower. Get rid of this for next time. And then what did I want to do here? Did I want to test? I think I want to test this. Because you're out of the... This is only a two range thing, okay? I think I want to test this so I know what this is later. I'm going to do that. It's not the trap. I'm just going to come over here. Now, uh, Roy's not strong enough to pierced me, but he is pretty bulky, and it's going to be close, so uh, we're going to throw a Lucina up here, after I get this ether, we know this is the trap, air can't finish the job, but if we use a combination of an ether and an air, will it be enough? Oh, I hope so, I really do, no! <laughs> Okay, I swear, yes, I had this. We needed Lucina's buffs to beat the Roy. Oh, it was really close. I thought, like, no, did I screw something up? It was Lucina's help, and that's how I beat Luna's team. So that was a lot of, a lot of fun. Uh, I did not try anything else but Ike, so I could maybe give that a shot with Leaf. Seems leafable because, again, there's really no rushdown that you have. There's really no Wings of Mercy traps. There's really no dancers, so I really appreciate, like, a nice, clean fight like that. It does involve a lot of impact and other gross things. So thanks for the fight, Luna. As I mentioned at the top of the program, uh, I will get to everybody on the, on the on the light queue. It sounded like three people now, so but those three people have been there for a while. Again, I apologize. If you want to be a part of the program, leave your leave a comment in this video with your in-game name and what season you want to be fought, and I will do my best to get you scheduled and fought in a timely manner. <sighs> okay, um, just one fight today because we did do three yesterday to, to save some time. Um, so let's do it. Uh, I guess I could do a quick preliminary look on a <laughs> good rematch kill me. Mm, okay, I mean, I'm tempted. We could do that. We also could get a revenge on Theo. I, I don't know. I, I, think I'm, I think I want revenge on Theo, but this is basically telling me this is an infantry pulse team. Okay, I mean, do we care? I want to get revenge on Theo. So it really, I only have those two rematches. One, two, three, three. Uh, okay. We'll do. Let's do it. I mean, how many, how many ladders do I have? I don't think I've used any. No. <laughs> I've taken some garbage stuff. So I have the luxury of trying this. So let's rematch Theo. Why not? Uh, look at the teams really quick. I'm pretty sure I haven't changed anything. Uh, it's been a lot of Team 1 and Team 3. Mila's been putting in some work. Uh, ah, yeah, the Mila, the Mila on this one let me down. So we did get finally a leaf into the fray yesterday. Take a look at that if you missed it. It's Theo 25 could be, okay, we're just usual suspects. We've got an Ophelia. We've got a Bram. It is in play. A lot of things. I don't like Bram here. Hmm. There just is the one dancer. <laughs> and they're trying their best to stop. I guess they're trying their best to stop uh, Fjorm, but Mila's here now. It's Bolt Tower. Lunge? No lunge. 
Well, this is tempting, guys, because if I shut the dancer down and I come right here, uh, Wings of Mercy? No Wings of Mercy. Uh, it doesn't matter. There is no ground orders or anything like that. So we can isolate the Bram just by shutting the dancer down. And then uh, I guess we can test the trap. We don't need the ether. So, yeah, this seems like a team three for sure. We're going to use Mila's isolation skill. Like this. That's what it, it is. Isolation, is it not? Where is, it, where is it coming from? This one? Yeah. Isolation on you. And then we'll go from there. Sound good? Um, I can't end here. So I do want to clear this out. So. Let's break this guy oh no 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 we cannot break that guy yet no 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 because that will bring you to the table which maybe not may not be a bad thing we could actually beat the you yes. like that but no 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 I want to <laughs> hmm it is a 30 and it's gonna potentially screw me up this bolt tower is there a way I can get out of this thing not right now. No, I can't. It's a pretty good position for that bolt tower. In this... This terrain is difficult. Okay, so let's break this. Test the trap. That's really what I want to do. Break this. Test the trap. If it is not the trap, well, let's go. So let's rally. Test the trap. Oh my god, it's not the trap! We've shut down the dancer. Let's do it! Looking forward to it. Again, we do not need the ether here. No lunge, so I don't have to worry about Ike getting in the back. There goes a rally, but kinda didn't want you to do that. There's you number one down, and then there's you number two down. And now Ninian's probably gonna go be Yeah, I put put you in a bad spot. Oh, Bram, 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 Bram. What are I, I gotta worry about you. I am panicked, so that's a bad, that's bad news. And you are gonna go, because we just talked about that, because you do not have the assist. You will rally, and then get, and then move, and then hit me, and then get danced. I should be able to take one Bram hit. And it is just, just turn two, so that's not gonna go off. It's all for you. Is it, though? Is it all for me? I don't know, I'm worried, because I didn't shut you down. Did not put Mila in the right spot to stop the Ninian, so this might be problematic. If I could get rid of the Ike, we could bait the Ninian. And that's probably enough to live through this. You've got an ether, bro. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this. My hunch is to step back. Do you have Wings of Mercy? You do have Wings of Mercy. So if the Ike doesn't die, maybe you'll Wings of Mercy him? Understood. Your orders. Orders. Like this. this is my hunch is just to step back Being here. Yes. Especially since you don't need the ether. But I, this is not good. He died, though. No, he did not. So there, we are going to get a jump. That's actually okay. I'm going to get all my health back. And now... I should be good. I should be okay. Because that rally is going to happen on you. You'll die. And then we'll... Eh, it's a 25. I should be able to take one, Bram. I should be able to take one. Or, alternatively, we could just you. break you. That rally will happen. And then we'll have one against... You know... But now that bolt tower's coming. <laughs> so. I was worried about the bolt tower. <laughs> this is bad. This is good. This little combination they have, they have here has actually worked out pretty well. Oh, can we stop? Can, can air deal with this? It will be done. 
Should we just have Bram take on Milla instead? This is a tough decision. You know, I've got four ladders. I just want to be done with this week. We will smoke him. I don't know. I don't think I can survive. I think I might need to do two things. Yes. Break the bolt tower and then smoke. The I just don't know if air's up to the challenge of beating a Bram. What do your things do again? Blah, blah, blah. If you're um, a penalty, guaranteed follow-up attack. You're going to get 25. They're going to put you at 29 damage. 29. You're going to get a push, which I don't... At the start of combat... Oh, this is just a normal push. This isn't... This isn't push four. Why do you not have push four on? Don't you come with push four? Okay, so that's not even going to apply. Oh. Okay. Like this. And my hunch is to do this. Break the Ninian, break the Bolt Tower. You don't look like you're going to be able to stop either of them. And then, I mean, what if Ophelia has the bright idea to... I don't know. I, I think I want to do that. Because if I don't... I mean, if this thing is not here, I would just sit here, let the rally happen, you'll come hit me, and then Ram's probably dead. I have two options. I probably want to do that, help you out a bit, because you're going to need the res. Is there panic anywhere? Ophelia's only plays either hit me or rally, and I think she'll want to rally. Uh, I'm not confident on that. Here comes the rally, and then what is Bram going to do? Is he going to kill the air? Yep. Yep, he killed the air. I guess I should have just played it with the... Uh... <laughs> now, technically... Uh, technically speaking, I ha if I take this, I have to promote a five-star healer because of that. Uh... Orders. So I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to do that. I don't care. I'm just gonna take this win. I, I maybe gave up top a thousand. I don't. I don't think I was close enough. We'll, we'll, we'll see. So that's another man. I, I took so much on the offensive. I took a hundred points on the offensive, Ben Theo. But I got my revenge. Now was that extra forty points enough to drop six hundred? I don't think so. So that really was it. Mean anything? I'm in this weird little gap between a thousand and three thousand, which I have to play perfectly to get out of. Or play miserably to get out of the 3,000 tier. So, I'll take that. And again, that, that tells me I can lose about 140 a, a week and still manage to sneak in the t under the top 3,000 mark. So, there you go, guys. Hope you had fun. I had fun. This is a fun week. I did lose the most points on offense I think I've lost in the last year. The whole year, probably combined. I mean, I don't think I've lost any points. I just took a bunch of junk. I'm tilted. I'm not letting that Bram even kill me. God, I hate Bram. Ah. Still, how did he survive the air? He's... Air? Come on, man. She had 50s. Ah. The bolt... I told you that bolt tower was going to get me. If that bolt tower wouldn't have been there, I would have sort of let Ike do his job. And he probably would have managed to survive that. <sighs> okay, I reminded myself to remind myself to look at the top 50. This is why I don't do it. Because <laughs> I'm just drained emotionally. And then this happens. I'm right in front of my router. What do I need to do? Run an Ethernet cable to my phone? Like, I don't know. I, I don't know what to say. Thanks, game. Thank you. All right, we'll round out the top 50... MB takes it this week. 30 points over Shining Luna. Congratulations, MB. I think that's the first time I've seen you on the top of the friends list. Followed by Fred, Sarango, 
Titea. I don't know who that is. Who, who's that? You changed your name. Randy and Kyle, Karstrick, and you round out the top 10. Harper right behind. I got 15, you know, if I would have... My max score was what? Uh, my max score was... 640? So I could potentially place... Here? This is as far as I can get. That's my max score. So I'm happy to be 15 on my own list. Uh, and the rest of you... The rest of you schmoes... <laughs> just kidding. Uh, round out the top 50... Congratulations uh, to making this far. So the, the the cutoff was right there with Mask at tier 27. Ashikai just missed top 27 by 20 points. Top 27. Tier 27. F your cap line indeed. And there you go, guys. I'll quickly look at the top players, see if anything's changed. I haven't looked at this in a while. I don't remember who that is. A lot of kanji up here. Cucumber. Hey, um, I, I played three houses like a lot, and I don't remember these. When did these happen? When when did these? Maybe they must have got breast implants for the beach. I guess. Maybe they made it to like an American version of a uh, whatever the Kieran can summer, summon, and then they had some uh, breast augmentation provided by. Kieran's homo. Maybe that'll be like a uh, paralogue where we get an explanation of why all these characters have en enormous breasts. Because I don't think they should have those. But what do I know? There's the top 50. 14,000 and now is the cutoff. I have no chance. Alright guys, next week is going to be Duma Hell Week. Yay! Hooray, Duma Hell Week. And then my bonus unit, I don't know who I'm going to use. I don't know. I, maybe but the healer risks. I do need a Everest is okay. I do need a range unit and the only range units uh, you're already light blessed I guess it's I guess it's risk. <laughs> I guess it's risk. Don't have any other choice So uh, I'll build him up and set your infantry schools. You can do that now watch this video set your stuff Don't be like me. No, I've set my stuff. I think no I didn't I did not I did not set it the day one this week first time that's happened in a while all right, guys, I'll stop rambling. I'll let you get on with your business. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.